blooming top tiles in uh, London and uh, Ruby do sponges. It's Johnny Boy, here I am, I'm in London. I've been doing many videos lately because I've got a new phone. Uh, it's the Samsung 10 Plus, but I'm with... Mike. And... Rod from Isleworth. And I've got to say, in Isleworth in London, isn't it, right? I've come in here because I'm looking for the bow grout for porcelain for rigid paving systems. And what have I bought? Bow, you bought the Rapid Set Grey can exterior. Yeah, and it's good stuff? 10 out of 10. And you told me earlier on, Raj, about... Um, the adhesive for sticking units to, to walls. Bow new flex fibre, you will not need no, no, no battens. The bonding on it is amazing. It would hold an 80 by 80 up on the wall and it won't slip a millimetre. And it goes off pretty fast as well, like you? It's a medium actually. So you've got slow setting, you've got rapid setting. This is in a medium. It's got Does that have like a waterproofer in there as well? Like, you know, so it, or you, would you, we still have to waterproof the wall to make sure the damp doesn't come through the wall? Still have to waterproof the wall. Still got to waterproof. We're getting good advice here. Um, just, I've got to say, I went into uh, Top Tiles in Cardiff, and the guy there, it must be in your training, you guys. They must be training you well, because customer do. service is absolutely second to none. So thanks very much, guys. No worries, John. Very you very have well. a good one. We've had to come into Salco's and uh, tell us uh, they've got no cement. In your landscape, in I'm in the Heath Sandwich shop in Twickenham, isn't it? Yeah. And I'm not going to show his face because he's a bit camera shy. And his name, what's your name? Steve. Steve, we, you know. And I tell you what, that has to be the best sandwich shop. Well, we'll soon see when we when we go and eat it later on. Yes. But we're just get, just going to give you a little look. We haven't tried it yet. Steve, thanks very much. We're going to enjoy the sandwich. Welcome. And we will be back and we're going to be posting a good review on you on Google. That's it. That's what I like. That's what I like. Well, we've uh, done the grouting, and uh, oh, my God, I was hoping to show you the actual, uh, excuse the grass on there, we're just, uh, we've concreted underneath. I was hoping to show you how we uh, had done this. Uh, we've used BAL, I'll post a picture of it on this video. BAL is uh, an adhesive company, and believe you me, there are a couple of marks on there, but that's all been washed down and wiped over. It's just where we've walked backwards and forwards now, so I don't want to go over it anymore. But as you can see, it's looking good. Uh, let's go down the path. You'll be able to see the path from here. There is probably about three places where we've got a couple of little gaps, and uh, I'm going to have to repoint those at a later. I don't want to do it now because I've actually got water on it, but it's started to dry now as well. So. But we've done it, hopefully that would have done the trick and uh, it's looking good. And uh, when the client comes back, I hope that he likes the color. We've used a gray because they want to use uh, a gray paint for the, for the garden shed and a, on a gray theme for the fence as well. So they've been great customers here. They've been absolutely fantastic, but we've not quite done now. And we're gonna stick down. This is the grass that was down before and we're gonna be sticking that down in the future. But it's more or less done now. Hopefully one more visit and we'll be done. But there we are. That's a porcelain and uh, looking good. Well, that's it. As you can see, I've got a bit of dust on me. Um, ah, uh, BAL, the adhesives, the grout. I understand a little bit more about it, how to mix it now and uh, how to put it in, how to install it and uh, it'll be a lot more easier next time and uh, when you actually think about how long that actually took and it, we weren't trying to rush but it was easy if I get this great off my hand there well let's come to that time again I've come back and as you can see the last couple of days I haven't done any videos I haven't done any posts on Instagram Twitter, LinkedIn, any of it. And the reason being, I changed my phone at last. My phone's been sat downstairs. My new phone, which I'm using now for the last um, nine weeks, I think it is. And uh, it's been difficult to say the least to get used to seeing where all the apps are. And uh, I'm just not used to it. Good phone. Okay. And uh, like I said, I've got some, a lot of GoPro equipment and I've got a decent Canon 80D and uh fantastic camera and i hardly use it because 
I'm always trying to get content out. It's so important to get content out and um, get it out in time and get it out as much as I can when I can. And uh, the phone uh, is the best way forward with that. That's the best way to, to do it, to, to get it out quick. And uh, I, I can just do it. It's, it's easy, it's simple, but not at present. But hopefully tonight I'll have another video out of what we've actually been doing today. And unfortunately, I wasn't able to show how we were doing the pointing today of this porcelain patio because the weather was so warm and I was concerned about uh, its cracking, uh, if it would crack. Yeah, I've just mentioned about whether I thought the, the porcelain, that the grout would crack and because um, I was concerned that it was hot. It's so important that um, you get this right. This is the crucial part to any patio. And uh, probably the most important part is the finishing part. And uh, the last thing you want to be doing is uh, regrouting, dragging all that grout between the joints. It's not a good thing to do. Um, I don't know if I made a mistake today. The only grout that was available was um, they didn't have enough of the normal exterior grout, but they had some rapid dry grout. And uh, we we used that and, uh, you know, it's going to dry fast. So just using the rapid Gotta go. Just using the rapid uh, obviously increased the curing time, so just use that and um, yeah, uh, let's see how it turns out. Hopefully, the customer will be giving me a quick ring or a call or a message to let me know how it looks. And I've asked him to sort of just run some water over it because it dried quick uh, as it was meant to. So um, let's just see. We'll be re returning back to that project very shortly, and I'll be able to give you an update on it then. So. In the meantime, I've got to go and price job. See you soon. How are we going? Right, okay. Um, I haven't been in many vlogs lately in videos. This, I say lately, it's only been a few days and it's simply because I've, I've had a new phone and I'm trying to get used to using it and uh, seeing where all the apps are, etc. It goes on and on. There's, uh, I don't know what to say really. Uh, have I failed? We've got a customer at the moment and uh, we've put the grey grout in for him, okay? And they are probably, without doubt, probably the best customers I've ever had they're so nice they're so humble they got so much integrity and uh, we want to look after them they've had a bad experience and now the grout is is grey and uh, that's not good in itself so um, it hasn't come up to the expectation so we have to deal with that now and there's no doubt in my mind 100% I will deal with it but I tell you what it's just you go to bed the last thing of the day and then you have these little problems like this and it's just a we've got to deal with it so i'll tell you and show you how it turns out <laughs> 